Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Time to Play. I'm your host, Raven, and we are back with South Park, the Stick of Truth. Oops. Didn't mean to bring out my blaster. <laughs> um. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh lord, it does more. Oh, well, oh, it does way more damage. I'm just gonna stick with that. I don't want to be swinging that around. Um, <laughs> jeez. Okay, hang on. I got a message from Randy. Greg is single now. I'm oh, sorry to hear that, buddy. These work around. She was holding me back. Hey, the elevator in the hallway to the right of the room, we were chatting. You can get out that way, but I might have broken the elevator when I used it. So now you'll have to fix it, sir. Sorry about that. Okay, um, maybe this one will work better, because I have three attacks. Good thing I have a lot of these large health potions. Good God.
Okay, never mind. It's better if I hit him with this. Move. Move. Ooh, let's go. Move. Move. It's a good thing I have a lot of that. Move! Move, move. Woo! Let's go! Move! Move! Woo! Let's go! Dude. Ah. I use cure. Uh, there's no need to heal, cause this is about dead. Let's go! My bad. <laughs> oh. Yes. At what location? How many people in the town? Uh oh. Get in there and cover it up. This could change everything. Get everyone moving. We've got another UFO crash. Oops. That's my bad. Oh, wait, do I still have that probe up my butt? A message from Randy. Thanks for getting me out of there. I tried to tell them to stop, but I'm too just too polite. Hey, new kid, thanks for playing with us yesterday. It was really fun. Hope y'all play with us again today. Whee! Hey, I tried to send you a link to a clip of Rabbit playing with a cat, but it's not working. It's pretty cute. You should look it up later. And that a large earthquake and several fires in the South Park area last night woke many residents from their sleep. Here with the report is a midget in a bikini. Tom, <laughs> the workers here are assuring everyone nothing out of the ordinary has happened. They claim that the only reason huge tents have gone up to cover this area is to mask the construction of a new Taco Bell, which will open sometime later this month. Thanks, Midget. I do love me some Taco Bell. The mayor of South Park states that last night's tremors and fires are under control and that hopefully schools and businesses can open again soon. Oh, my God! They came out of nowhere! There was a huge earthquake, and then, and then there was burning in my yard! It's horrible. You don't understand. The elves, they took the stick! And it's bullshit, because that is totally cheating. We specifically said no trying to take the stick at night. Elves are dirty little liars, and we have to lay waste to their entire base! You okay. have some incredible ability to make friends quickly, Sir Douchebag. I'm sending you on a quest to go out into the lands of Zaron and recruit a whole nother faction to Koopa Keep. Find the goth kids and give them this letter. Get them to join our kingdom, and we shall lay waste to the drow elves once and for all! Fucking cheaters.
To the goth kids! <laughs> Let's see you again, Princess Kenny. Let us make haste! I don't know either. Stop it! Ah, ah. Oh wait. You want some of this? Oh wait, I have that power. Oh jeez. <laughs> There's still a hole in there. School is canceled. Taco Bell rules. <laughs> oh, I thought I could shoot it. To the goth kids! <laughs> Let's go! To the goth kids! To the goth kids! Who's that? I think it's that new kid people are talking about. Beat it, new kid. This area is strictly for goth kids. What's this? I did that Join a while ago when I was in my goth face. The wicked elves. All recruits welcome. Sorry, Frodo. We don't play Dungeons and Douchebags. Yeah, beat it, new kid. Oh, come on. Let's do it. We never do anything. No way. We can't do what this kid asks us to do. He's a conformist. Look at his clothes and his hair. Yeah, I'll tell you what, new kid. Get the right clothes and some cigarettes and coffee and then talk to us again. Yeah, if you want to prove you aren't a conformist, then you need to look exactly like we do. Then maybe we'll consider hanging out with you. If your clothes make me strong, then yeah, sure. Okay, so. Quest. Okay, but where would I find those? Hang on, let me first. The Grand Wizard said that I'm in charge of the shop now because I sound like Clyde. I don't sound like Clyde. Anyways, welcome, weary traveler. Would you like to see my wares? Yeah, I don't know why. You don't sound like him at all. have anything but first I have a bunch of junk
Face cash. Yo, 11 bucks? Another shop. Tip back. Don't forget to bring a towel. Do what Tally says, I guess. The stick is ours. Last cigarette. You guys got more? Yeah, we just stole a fresh pack. Not okay, so I'm guessing I have to beat up the sixth graders to get a cigarette. What can I do for you, do kid? Well, first, I want to see what weapons you got. Oh. Oh. Do I have anything? These. Oh, I don't have anything. Oh. Do for you, dude. I will get that katana if it's the last thing I do. Get lost, kid. We're trying to smoke here. Take your stupid hair and leave. Take your stupid hair and leave. <laughs> Stuff to sell. I know it's probably not gonna be a lot, but 
What can I do for you? Man, bear, pig. Oh, that's where the outfit is. good that's a good one right oh wow i'll give you a good price you better that is a good price i'm surprised i can't sell stuff to him oh yes he is a beggar so So good, I can't wait until I get it. Humanity every turn, jeez. Okay, um... Keep that because that's good to have. Oh, I put it on the wrong one. <laughs> it's supposed to be this one. Oh, coffee. No, we buy the coffee. Was there anything else? I don't remember. Welcome to my coffee shop. Thanks for helping Tweak out in the back room. Would you like to try some coffee? All right, return to the goth kids. Hey, there oh. he is. New kid. New kid. The Elf King has requested your presence. You can either come quietly or you can fight, but I warn you, fighting this fight at this point in the game is a complete waste of time, and you might as well skip it and just come with us. 
You chose wisely, new kid. Come with us. What happened? Uh, now I wanted to know what would happen in the fight. Would they just take me anyway? Of course. I can't tell if that spear is real or not. It looks fake. So, looks here's real. the new kid everyone is talking about. What's your name? He doesn't talk, Elf King. He thinks he's hot shit or something. I'm... I'm mute. I can't talk. You're playing for the wrong side, dude. What did Wizard Fatass tell you? That we broke the rules and took the stick last night? He's lying. Cartman is the one you should be fighting against. He's hiding the stick, which is cheating, and acting all betrayed and sad to get you to recruit more people for him. We tracked a Twitter raven who says you are currently trying to recruit the Goths for the wizard. Go recruit them, but bring them to us. Then we can ransack Cartman's stupid kingdom and get the stick back once and for all. I'm trusting you to do what's right. And kid, if you betray us, we'll tell everyone you're a butthole. I could care less, but dude, uh, sure. <laughs> Yo, going against Cartman? I could care less. Let's go. All right. Our best <clears throat> ranger to help guide you. The bard is also at your disposal now. Woo, pretty. Get so many people. Oh, I need three more people as my friends. Shoot. I guess they work. I guess I work for the elves now. Oh joy, it's Butthole the Barbarian from the Dungeons of Dumbass. You gotta admit, he looks better. Yeah, he's almost a goth. Being goth isn't just how you dress, it's a frame of mind. It's time for you to prove that you go against society's rules. Yeah. There's a big PTA meeting happening right now at the community center. You need to walk right into the middle of that meeting and tape this sign to their table. Yeah, that will prove your individuality. Go on, beat it, and don't come back until you have a picture of that sign taped to the PTA table. All right. <laughs> Defy the rules of society. Let's go. <laughs> Dude, I'm emo now. <laughs> Whatever, man. I could care less about what you Butter's got a horrible snuggie over there. Have you tried Tweak Brothers coffee? It's terrible, but for some reason I can't uh, stop yeah, drinking it. Yeah, have fun in there. I think I'll wait it out. Wow, dude. You're like so fucking annoying. <sighs> it isn't right, I tell you. Out of nowhere, this huge Taco Bell is being built, and now our children are missing precious school time. Parents, we can assure the that they're working to fix whatever problems they're holding inside. Like, zoom, zoom. Who do they think they are? They think we're gonna see a, a Taco Bell as being more important than our kids' educations? What if it's not really a Taco Bell we're dealing with? Thanks for coming, new kid. Everyone, this is the kid whose family just moved to town. We've become very close friends. His name is. What's your name? He, he, well, I'm, anyway, I'm this child and I witnessed something last night, and I'd like you to hear his story. Go ahead, kid. I, I can't talk, dude. I'm mute. Tell them, you know, about all the... Go ahead, tell them, tell them that stuff. Throat no work. This is a waste of everyone's time. If the PTA isn't going to do something about Taco Bell taking over, then the rest of us parents will. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Just holding Come that on. side. It's just like... I don't know what to do. Fuck the conformists. Why, are they a good lay? Oh my god. Look, I know how you're feeling, okay? But this isn't gonna solve anything. We've got to get inside that Taco Bell and find out what's really going on. Help me with that and I'll help you with this. I saw you on the ship. 
You have pretty good control over your farts. Meet me in the bathroom. It's time for you to learn some real power. Oh my god, dude, just let me do something for once in my fucking life. Dude. Okay, I guess I'll learn the real power and then I guess end the episode here. Let me show you what I mean. Come at me. Try and fart on me. Come on. Hi, <laughs> cha! See that? Your fart's over there somewhere. Didn't come close. So, what do you do when people can block your farts? You must learn to control your farts to move and release at a specific time and place. I'm going to teach you a fart called the Sneaky Squeaker. It will become your greatest ally. Don't believe me? Try and block my attack. Jesus. See that? I distracted you. Distracting your opponents is key to battle. Look, let me show you again. Pay special attention to the viscosity. Hey, hold A D. Okay, you try. Make your fart detonate behind me. Undisciplined. Even a child could block that fart. Look, let me show you again. Pay special attention to uh. the viscosity. Okay, you try. Make your fart detonate behind me. Oh, hey, guys. Oh, Mr. Mackey. Now it's your turn. Use Sneaky Squeaker to distract me. Oh, my God. <laughs> there. Did you guys hear that? Sounded like a chipmunk. Giga! Very good. <laughs> now use what I taught you to sneak inside that taco bell. Find out what they're up to and report back here. And no matter what happens, never fall on the balls. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was good. Oh, that was good. All right, thank you all so much. <laughs> oh, all right, thank you all so much for watching, and I hope to see all of you <laughs> in the next one. <laughs> see ya.